Here comes broccoli! No! Ew! Come on, you need to eat vegetables! Open your mouth! Oh well! Okay! Huh? Hey! No! It's Grandma! Just look how many snacks she brought! Goodbye, broccoli, and hello, donuts! This is real heaven! Mom! She needs to eat vegetables! Oh, okay, okay. I'll think of something. Hmm. A clock? What is grandma going to do? Oh, wow! And what is this? A game with all kinds of food? How fun! There are some veggies and some snacks. She can spin the arrow and eat whatever it points to. Now even some vegetables won't hurt. What a smart move, grandma! Hey! Even mom is spinning the arrow! Oh my! Chocolate! Yay! Lucky! Mom is carefully preparing sandwiches for her daughter. But maybe she's trying a bit too hard. The girl is gonna be late to school! Here! This sandwich is pure perfection! Now put this one on top… Um… Can you hurry up, mom? Now just put it into our lunchbox… Here we go! Ha! Finally! Can I go now? No, no, no! One more thing… You want your sandwiches to be fresh, right? Here! Let's put it into a cooler! Oh my! But this bag is huge! Is it really worth it for just one sandwich? Yes! All ready! Now you can go to school! Now this is too much! Maybe grandma can help her out! What are you doing? Stop, stop, stop! You're gonna ruin your back with this! What? A lunchbox? Oh my! It seems that grandma strongly disapproves of mom's method. Hmm, wait a minute. A sponge? I know exactly what to do. Oh look, she put the sponge into the freezer. La 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 la. But what's up with that? No more huge coolers. Here, just put a frozen sponge into your lunchbox and you're good to go. Thanks, Grandma! Good job, Granny! Is Charlotte eating candy while gaming? Oh! Grandma won't let her eat so much sugar! Hey! No need to overact! Eat some healthy food, my dear! You need it! Ew! I don't want to! It's boring! Good thing I have some Coke! My dear, what are you thinking, kiddo? Give it to me! That's so bad for you! How many times do I have to tell you? Oh, wait! I know! <laughs> you can use any can to make something cool! Cut the back of it like this. And voila! You have a spiral grater for fruits or vegetables to make it more fun to eat! Jump! Jump! Yeah! Huh? What's that? Here you go, honey! You'll love these spirals! Let's play a game! Whoever eats everything first without hands wins! Okay! Charlotte is looking strong while Grandma is sweating! Grandma lost her teeth! <laughs> Whoopsie daisy! And the winner is. Charlotte! Benjamin is hungry! Corn time! Smells delicious! And look at the cool gadget I have here! It's going to peel all the corn off easily without any mess or struggle! You see? Easy peasy! Nice! Those modern gadgets are stupid. Wait, I think I have an idea. Let's see. Grab a toothpick, put it through the corn, and pull them off. Perfect! Hmm, finally something to put in my stomach. That's a huge bowl of corn! 
But it seems Grace has a better option. Hmm, it's so easy and fun to eat corn like this. I love it. I did it myself. <laughs> oh no, Avery's freaking out. At least she can enjoy that huge bowl of corn by herself. No! What just fell down from the sky? What? Is that meat? Ew, it's sticky! You could cook something delicious with that. Hmm, let me think. I know! What does she have there? A flower? Whoa, nice! Ouch! Why would you do that? It hurts! Just look at Avery. She is making the dough already. Of course, it's not just a flower. It's a gadget to make dumplings! Impressive! Nice! Voila! Huh? What am I gonna do? Mmm! Perfect! Look how many dumplings I've already made! Shh! I'll just take some of her dough. No one will notice. Is it really going to work? Wow! Let's see how Grace will make dumplings on her own without any gadgets. She's using a fork! How smart! Although it takes some time and strength. But I'm sure she can handle it. It's time to put these beautiful dumplings into the boiling water. Done! What? But how? Grace did no worse. Her dumplings are ready to eat. What a plot twist! Not so fast. Try mine first. Huh? I'll just put these here. Yeah, that's better. My dumplings! Yikes! Oh well, what can you do? Ugh! I can't open it! It's stuck! What should I do? My hands are gonna fall off! Hey girls, what's up? Can't open it? Pfft, let me do it. Ugh! Hold on a second, I'm sure I can handle it. Apparently a handsome boy isn't that hand strong. Come on, give it to me. I know how to open the jar without any struggles. Is that some kind of toy? Oh, that's a jar opener. Look how easily the lid came off. Wow. I'll show you a trick as well. And for this one, you don't need any crazy gadgets. What's she gonna do with that tape? Watch me. What? That's impossible. Wow, you're so smart! No one cares! This is so stupid! Show me what you got! Bring it on! Hi, Benjamin! Ah! I'm the best warrior! And I know a cool hack! Let me show you! Wow! Put the stick through the cucumber and cut around it! Well, that looks interesting! Easy! Now even the sliced parts out. It's gonna be much better with my cucumber slicer. See how thin and beautiful the pieces look? OMG! It's time for Benjamin to decide which he prefers. Oh, he's already eating the cucumber! Huh? Where did he go? I don't understand! Girls, maybe he's not a huge fan of sliced cucumbers! Aw, that's so cute. The family's having dinner together. Mom prepared some tasty food. But wait, is that broccoli? Just look at this. Seems even dad is not enjoying his meal. But I think the kids just found a meal that they love. That's smart. Finally, some flavor in my mouth. Just look at dad. No one likes eating broccoli. Seems like he wants to join in the kids' idea. Kids, let me have some of your chips. Hey, what are you doing? That's not good. You have to eat the broccoli. It's healthy. Ew, we don't, we don't want, want your broccoli. broccoli. Hmm, what am I supposed to do now? Wait a minute. I figured it out. Kids, come here. It's time to have dinner. Broccoli. Wait, what is that? It's a game. Let's hope no one will get the broccoli here. See? Everyone's so happy eating all this delicious food. That's so great. No 
one wants to lose their turn and have to eat broccoli. Oh no, Dylan just landed on pink. That means broccoli? Poor Dylan. I bet mom is so proud right now. Now it's my turn, my turn. Oh, yikes, I was not ready for that. This is gross. Well, at least mom is happy seeing the others eat their vegetables. Wow, today's dad's birthday. Isn't that amazing? What a nice celebration. I think the kids made an amazing present for dad by themselves. Oh no, it seems the present is going to be ruined. What have you done? It was you, it's your fault. What is she going to do? She better have a good idea of how to save dad's birthday. I know what to do. Close your eyes. Let's take these and let's go on a mission to save dad's birthday. Come on, kids. Take two big plastic bottles and empty them. Mmm, we'll save it for later. Put the bottle down on its side and cut it into one bigger and one smaller part with a blade. Don't worry, even if it's a bit challenging. Everything is possible. It's going to be such a cool gift. Dad will be very happy, I'm sure. Let's move on to the other steps, shall we? Now it's time to glue those two parts together. Careful, the glue is hot. Place the parts one on top of another, and we are halfway there. Now let's make it even better. Take a can of spray paint. Shake it once. Shake it twice. Shake it very well. After you're done shaking, spray it on the bottle. Spray, spray, spray. And there you go. Now you have a trophy. That's so cool. Put it on the table and get ready to make the trophy even cooler. All kinds of glittery trimmings will help you here. Place them however you like. And don't be shy to add as much shiny glitter as possible. The more, the better. Dad's going to be so excited. This is an amazing gift. After you've decorated with the trimmings, you can be sure that's it. One more thing for the best dad's birthday, right? Nice job, guys. Dad, you can open your eyes now. Happy birthday, Dad. This is for you. OMG, that's for me? This is so cool. Come here, my little ones. This is the best birthday present I've ever gotten. Come on, say cheese. No, what am I going to do? How did this happen? Yikes, what a mess. Oh, hi. Your makeup's so nice and smells so good. I'm going to take a bite. No! Are you out of your mind? Lipstick is for your lips, but you can't eat it. Hmm. Oh, here you go. Eat the chocolate. Wait a minute. I have an idea. Prepare yourself some pink chocolate chips, an empty lipstick container, a spoon, and a candle. Take a full spoon of chocolate chips and heat it up until they've finished melting. Then fill the container with this delicious pink liquid. Mmm, yummy! There it is, your own edible nice pink lipstick. Wow, that's amazing! Yum! Looks like Mom's going somewhere. Oh, here comes Layla. Hi, Mom. What are you doing? I want to put on some makeup as well. Of course. Here you go, sweetie. That's an amazing lipstick, you'll see. You can taste it as well. Try it. Wow, so cool. That's the best lipstick ever. Time for some delicious corn. The family loves eating corn. All right, enjoy your... What? No! Unfortunately, not everyone in the family has good table manners. Oh my, what a mess! Come on, guys, what are you doing? Use the fork! Yum! What delicious corn! Oh, some got stuck in my teeth. Phew! Pear! Much better. You need a toothpick, too? Here you go. Wow, messy eaters, these two. Mom's patience is being tested here. But don't worry, she has some ways to teach them good manners. Let me demonstrate to you. What? What is this? Huh? Oh, wow! What a cool gadget! It peels the corn perfectly. 
And it's not messy at all! But Grandma is not intrigued. She knows a better way! Just put a toothpick through the kernels like so! And pull them off! Voila! Wow! What a brilliant hack! Grandma, you really are full of knowledge! Well, guys, see? What? Looks like Grandma's hack was more useful! Sorry, Mom! You lost on this one! Well, cheer up! You can still enjoy your corn! Oh, look! It's Grandma with her granddaughter! But Grandma isn't happy about these unhealthy snacks! Watch this! You should be eating fruit! Like this banana! Here, take a bite! Okay, I'll try it! Oh no! Not for me! Kids these days! Good thing I have an idea! I will make her eat more fruit! While Grandma is cutting a banana into big chunks, Charlotte is eating snacks again! What? But sweetie, a banana is good for you! Give up on this junk food! No way! Oh! But Grandma wouldn't be Grandma if she couldn't think of something! She's a cool granny! She's using a fork to make the banana slices look better! Well, that looks interesting! Nice! Well done! Now it's easy to eat them! Yay, Granny! You made her eat more fruit! Now enjoy your tea! Well done! La 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 la! Hey, honey! What? Chips? No, no way! That's so unhealthy! Please! Hey, I think it's a perfect opportunity to use my new gadget! Let's see… Oh! Is this supposed to seal the bag? Wow! It worked! Here, completely sealed! Now if you open it… I'll know! Mom is very strict when it comes to snacks! Poor Charlotte! Looks like you'll have to give up on chips for today! But Grandma can't take it! Sweetie, give that bag to me! Wait, what is Grandma doing? If Mom sees the bag open… The girl will be in trouble! What are they gonna do now? Let's hope she has some sort of a plan! Okay, now watch me closely! Mom and her funny gadgets! I know a better way! Put some foil on the bag and iron it! And done! The bag is good as new! But shh! It's our little secret! What a sneaky move, Grandma! But will it really work on Mom? Success! Who's this creepy man? I suspect he's a fishman! Look, he has something fresh for you girls! And it seems he's hungry! What are we supposed to do with these fish? Ew! They smell disgusting! Yikes! Fortunately, I have this amazing thing! Look how easily the scales are peeling off! It's a lifesaver! This is so satisfying to watch! Let's hope Grace comes up with some kind of plan! Looks like she has one! She is using a mixer! And the scales are coming off too! Wow! I wasn't expecting that! That's how it's done! OMG! Uh-oh! Looks like we have a third fish in the kitchen! Uh-oh! Hey! Where's my food? I'm starving! Whoopsie! I guess you'll need to wait a bit longer! Ready, set, go! <laughs> Stop it! I have a better idea! That's what you can do instead of fighting! I think we'll get to see who has better skills as a sushi master! Are you ready? Let's do it! Let's see a fair and honest sushi fight! This is so exciting! I'm going to make the best and the roundest sushi with my cool gadget! It doesn't seem very complicated, 
You just put all your ingredients inside. Make sure you press everything down very well. The last step is to close it. And push the naked sushi out on top of the seaweed sheet. It's so easy. Now you roll your sushi up. And that's it! Perfect sushi! Wasn't that complicated, was it? You think you're better with your modern plastic toys? I'll show you! I can see that Grace is pretty confident in herself. Let's see if her sushi will look as good as Avery's. She puts all the ingredients into the ice tray. And then she flips it upside down. This is also pretty easy. Well, everyone has their own way of making sushi. Hey, look what we have here! This is the coolest thing in this kitchen. Look, look at my I sushi! I tried so hard! What? My finger! It's stuck! Um, that's not charming at all. Yeah, that's awkward. Oh, how cozy is that? Everyone is friendly, chilling and drinking their tea. Whoa, look at that smile. Um, I think you have something in your… Hey, Benjamin, just let me… Okay, that's enough. Follow me. I know what to do. You put the tea inside this cute little toy. And then you just hang it on the edge of the mug. Let's pour some hot water inside. And it'll be all done. As always, Avery's pockets are full of cool gadgets. Wow, there are no more tea leaves floating in the cup. How inventive! Aww. Oh god! What is that? I almost got killed! I have a feeling Grace won't let this slide. She's on her way to show Benjamin a brilliant hack. Grab a spoon and scoop everything out of the orange peel. Now grab the empty peel. Make a little hole in the middle. Grab a cup. Add the tea. And pour in some water. There you go! Huh, what a convenient idea! Maybe a bit weird, but still cool. Ugh. Don't worry, maybe Benjamin will be impressed by your idea next time! Whoa! Slow down! What is that? Did he just bring us a chicken? It looks like eggs. Oh yes! Egg time! I'm gonna cook the most beautiful eggs with these cute shapes! Wow, if you want to fry yourself a cute heart-shaped egg, these gadgets are a must! I'm so excited to see how it's going to turn out! Ta-da! Wow, looks so cool! Thank you! But it looks like Grace has something in mind as well. What's she gonna do now? Grab some hot dogs, cut them into thin slices, then grab a toothpick and make whatever shape you like. Grace is making a star. Now carefully crack the egg into the pan and fry it. Let's see which one Benjamin chooses now. OMG! Star eggs with hot dogs? I can't believe it! This is unbelievable! See? And it wasn't even that hard. Better luck next time, Avery! Come on, come on! Go to the right! What are you doing there? Let me see. Wait, it's not good to sit on your chair like that. You have to sit with your back straight. Yeah, just like this. Hey. Oh well, there's not much I can do about it. Who is that woman? Is that Layla when she's old? Oh no, look at her all crumpled. No, 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 I need a solution right now. I'll be right back. A belt? What's he going to do with that? Let's watch and find out. Just look at Layla's back! Wow, now she can play games and sit straight. Dad's a real genius. Hmm? What's that? Oh, 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 let me go! Oh, I'm so exhausted and thirsty. I'll just have a few sips of my favorite drink. Oh no, the kids will go nuts for the soda! Mm, I need a plan right now. Think I know what to do. Take a spray bottle, open it, fill it with your favorite drink, and close it. There you go! A secret drinking device. Hi there, my little angels. Oh, don't mind me. I'm just going to water the plants. A bit over here, a bit over there. 
and a bit for me. <laughs> yum, yum. <laughs> it's been a long day, my son. Sleep well and have sweet dreams. See you in the morning. What's going on in here? Something feels spooky. Are those ghosts? Oh my, that's terrifying. Watch out, Dylan. There's one right behind you. What happened? Tell me, what is it, son? Dad, there are ghosts in my room. I saw them. Please don't let go. I'm so afraid. Oh. Uh, wait, I might have an idea. No, I know. Take a paper cup, flip it, cut the bottom out, flip the cup the normal way around, and put a piece of paper on it. Then draw a bunny on the paper and cut it out. Stick the paper to the cup and place a phone's flashlight under the cup. And voila, you're done. Wow, dad knows how to make things right. Let's watch and see if this works for Daniel. Hey son, look, I have something for you. You see, this is your new friend for during the night. He's going to jump around and save you from those ghosts. Wow, dad, that's awesome. You're my hero. I'm not scared anymore. Pop, 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 and no ghosts at all. Good night, my boy. I'm the best dad ever. Such a lovely afternoon here. Everyone is doing their own thing. Hey, Dad, where are you going? Wait for me. Oh, no, the door. It's going to hurt a lot. Wait, just look at Mom. Will she be able to save Dylan? Wow, she's a hero. She saved Dylan's hand. Oh, my little boy, are you okay? Are you hurt anywhere? Oh, come here. Wait, I think Mom is up to something. Let's find out. Take a pool noodle and cut it in half with a blade. Take the one half of the pool noodle and cut it vertically. Put it firmly around the door. Let's check. You see, it works. Amazing. Oh, shoot, the door. Looks like Dylan's in danger again. The pool noodle! Oh, that was close, but Mom's trick worked so well. Mom is really smart, isn't she? Welcome to the championship of cutting! Mom is using her newest kitchen gadget, and Grandma is going old school. Are you ready, Mom? Always. Are you ready, Grandma? Of course! First round, go! Easy for me. Just put some here and voila. Smart. Never think twice. That's so silly. I only need this stick. We'll just put mushrooms like this. One after another. And then I can easily cut them way faster. That's so smart. I can't even tell who's winning. Look. Mom is coming to a stop. She's finished. But wait! Grandma is drinking her tea? She was the first to cut all the mushrooms! You did it, Grandma! You're the winner! Yay! Oh, really? Okay, let's do that again. Everyone is ready for the next round? It's a tomato! For me, this is easy. This time, I'm going to drink the winner's tea. Grandma has something on her mind. She just brings her tube and puts a sharp blade inside. Now she's going to throw them inside. Like a basketball player. That actually works amazingly. Mom is working really hard too. Let's see who's the winner. What? Already? I haven't finished yet. My granny is the winner. Here is your medal! You don't say! Don't be sad, Madison! You can learn from her! It's pizza time! Mom came home with a freshly baked pizza! What a great mom! Now you have to cut it in half! Oh, wait, honey! I have a call! I'll just leave it here. I'll be back soon. Hello? But I want to eat it while it's hot. But I can't pick it up. Ugh! It's too hot! My fingers hurt! 
Oh, I know. I'll reach for a knife. Oh no, that's dangerous. It's too high. And the knife is so sharp. Be careful. No, what are you doing? You could get hurt. You could just wait for me. Wait, I can make something. Just wait, sweetie. I'll never get to eat this pizza. Sweetie, look. This is for you. A bicycle? It's not just a bicycle. It's a pizza cutter. You see how it goes through the pizza? Here, try it. That's so fun! And easy, too! Finally, a piece of pizza. Hooray! So good! I'll have a bite, too. Quality family time. Nice job, Madison. <laughs>